Just a young gun with a quick fuse. I was uptight, wanna let loose. I was dreaming a bigger. F okay, I thought I'd do a quick review on these uh, Oxford uh, hot grips. Um, I've had them fitted now for about two months, um, so I can give them quite a good review, considering. Um, they cost forty nine ninety nine. They come in different versions as well. I bought the sports ones, and the only difference is is like the thickness of the grip. But the sports, they, they're really comfy these on, considering they're sports ones, and they're. Yeah, they're super easy to install. All, all you do is you just wire it straight onto the battery. Oh, it's the black, it's the black terminals there. But um, yeah, you just wire it straight onto the battery, and then it'll work when the engine's not running. You can turn it off, load. And then what happens? It detects if your battery starts to get a little bit low. It'll actually shut down and switch off, so it doesn't actually it doesn't completely kill your battery, which is a good little function. And uh, they get really, really hot. Um, you, you can't put them one hundred percent. You just you have to keep taking your hands off. It just burns your hands. Um, Fifty percent is good. The only thing I don't like is the way that bits that wires there. But the way I've routed it, it does look. It does feel alright. But um, highly recommended. Um, if you're after some heated grips, I would 100% go for the uh, Oxford hot grips, um, and they're good value for money. I've seen others around about the same price, and they look the quality looks a lot, a lot more so rubbish, I should say. So yep, if you're out for some heated grips now the winter's coming in, go for the Oxford uh, hot grips. Okay, bye.